Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkiverse. This week, I thought I'd share with you guys a nifty little trick that I've been using for a while now, allowing me to unlock my PC and laptop using my phone's fingerprint scanner. All you need for this tutorial is your Windows PC, your Android phone, and be on the same network. But before we jump right into it, make sure to like and subscribe to get more Android tips, tricks, and customization videos. So, let's start by first installing a small application on our Windows PC, which I'm going to leave a link for in the description below. This will allow Windows to run a super simple script from on your lock screen, unlocking your PC without you manually entering your password. Perfect for those of you like me who have extremely long passwords, or if you simply just want to show off your fingerprint unlock to your friends. Just simply run the installation file located within the zip folder. This process is fairly straightforward, but just make sure to click yes to allow the application to add itself to your firewall exemption list. Saying that, make sure your network is set from public to private, or you may experience issues trying to connect to your Windows PC. Now that we have the installation complete, let's pair it to our Android phone. For this, we need to make sure we lock our Windows PC. And once you've done that, let's jump over to our phone. So here, we want to head to the Play Store and grab ourselves the app, Remote Fingerprint Unlock. This is what we're going to use to connect to the Windows application that we just installed. And as a quick note, for those of you wondering, you can grab this custom live wallpaper from my very own custom collection app. The link for this is also in the description below. So moving on, once you've installed the app, the first thing you want to do is register your fingerprint. After which, let's use the scan option to look for our PC. Now here, you have a few different ways of connecting to your computer. However, what we're going to be using is the scan option. Just give it a few seconds to complete the process and your computer name should appear on the list. But if it doesn't, as I mentioned, it's most probably to do with your computer's network settings. So make sure to double check it and you can even try adding your computer through its IP address or even through Bluetooth. So once you see on the list, simply select it and hit save. Now let's head over to the account section and add in our login details. Here, just select your PC and hit add account. Now as directed by the app, just simply type your Windows username and password. And just like that, we're done. Now using the app, you'll be able to unlock your PC whenever you're on the same network. Now the pro version of this app does come with a handful of additional features, including support for Wake on LAN and even the ability to add a quick unlock widget to your Android home screens. But of course, as a free user, having to manually find and open the app every time you want to unlock your PC is just simply too long a process. So as a simple workaround, if your launcher supports gestures just like Nova does, then simply head into the gesture settings and assign the app to open whenever you do an on-screen action. Such as here, I have it assigned to the action, double tap and swipe up. And as a final note, because it tries to unlock your PC for 20 seconds at a time, you can even start the process before your computer is even turned on, which will immediately unlock Windows. If you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure you like and subscribe to help support the channel. And make sure you check out my other Android customization videos. See you next time on Into the Parkiverse.